Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today's topic is how you can change uh, language options in data table. Like uh, if you will see text show 10 records and you can change that to display 10 records. Search text then in the left bottom there is showing results 0 of 0 and previous and next in this video I will change each one how you can change the text suppose you have multilingual site and you want to change data table into multilingual so you can also use there these options so now let's start writing code firstly create index file then write basic HTML structure give title data table language after that copy css from bootstrap site and paste in head after that copy script and paste that in the last of body now create div with class container then another div with class row and one more div with call empty 12 write Heading data table language tutorial. After that, create table class table table border. Write T head, then T R T D. In T D, write serial number, name, contact, and then email. After that, write T body, T R T D. Serial number one, name is knowledge. Contact let's say one to nine numbers. Email is going to be knowledge at the redemo.com. Let's check this in browser. So now let's get the data table JS and CSS. So open data table, copy CSS and paste in head section, copy JS and paste that in script after that open documentation now second point i'm just copying that create script and paste that here now give id to table that is my table okay now refresh the browser and data table is working properly all four things are coming now let's create one more entry serial number 2 name thruster 2 change phone number and let's go and refresh the browser again now we have two entries search anything so search is working now I am opening language options for data table that is documentation and that's an example table you can see show entries and search showing result previous next after search text also changes so in example table you can see these are written different in search auto like nothing found sorry is coming and bottom text is also different second page is for all the options available for language the so copy language and paste in data table then remove inner and copy all the language option and paste here so now let's do it one by one first one is decimal if I will open language option page and open decimal one, it basically detects number which uses a comma in a decimal place. So that's you can use if you want to deal with number. So next is empty table. So let me show you this. I'm just going to empty the table and refresh the browser it says 
no data available in table so if i'll change that to no entries and again check refresh the browser again so it's showing no entries next is info showing start to end of total entries so in browser you can see this in left bottom so let's change that remove showing and rest is same now let's move to browser and check there you can see now showing is removed you should not remove this underscore one as these are the countings so next is info empty if table is empty then what will display in left bottom refresh browser and it is also working perfectly after that next is info filter let me show you if i'll search to in the left bottom there is text filtered from total entries you can change this text through info filter change it to results now let's back to browser search again and now result is coming next is info post fix it's basically for append extra info to the info string thousand is also for numbers used with decimals now let's move to next that is length menu it's the left top text that is displayed so let's change it and display menu records let's check in browser so text is changed so next is loading records well i have just two data this will be displayed if you are loading data with ajax next is processing well when table is processing a user action like uh, sort command or similar something so next is search it's the text on right top so let's change it to search table so let's check in browser and it's changed now next is zero records if i'll search anything and no matching data is found so let's change that to no search results found again search something and it is displaying no search result found next is paginate next and previous button text in right bottom you can change text to previous and just n then refresh and changes are reflected for first and last let me create a loop and create 40 entries let me again do entries 400 for first one thing i need to enable is full pagination paginate type full number then refresh now you can see first and last button so now let's change text first to l and last to l so let's check so it's working properly in browser so now last language option is ascending and descending so let's go to documentation so that's an attribute added to t head so it is actually not visible so let's inspect and go to t head now and td are having this area label attribute and it's taking the text that is defined in ascending and descending so if I'll change ascending to ASC and check in inspect. So if I'll go to the. So now you can see it's actually changing. And if I'll change order. So you can see for descending it's still taking the complete descending spelling.
so in this video i have completely shown you all the language options you can use to change the text of table according to your need so thank you so much for watching please like share and subscribe to my channel